Welcome everyone to Let's Get On With It Live, where we do occasionally, when we're not experiencing the joys of Harlan Ellison together, somehow, despite everything, get on with it. I remain your local necromancer, Grimith. Yippee. Last broadcast was several hours back. We had fun. It was it was the most off-topic broadcast of Mortal Glory 2. It was uh, an educational and informative. It was also the most awake I've been during one of these Mortal Glory 2 broadcasts. So yippee for that. I got a magic card out of it, designed by Azor Rain and posted in my Discord server, discord.gg slash Grimith, under fan art. I will not show that on podcast. That's called Influencer Grimith, forcing you to join a Discord server just to see a fan art picture before you disconnect from the Discord server. Huh? You like that? What I will show you is that uh, sometime in the wee hours of the morning, I booted up this game and did a quick run. These go much quicker when I'm not broadcasting and chatting and can focus my full brain power upon the video game. It's kind of frightening. Uh, this is going to be spoilers for the last run. I lost. It's the first loss I've had playing Mortal Glory 2. Uh, I suffered a few over the course of my uh, time playing the first game, and so I needed a rematch, Glory Level 9. Or rather, didn't need to, desired it. Now, I can't show you a run history because, you know, this game doesn't have that, but I got a couple screenshots, actually four. We have Get Fucked Incorporated versus the Tribunal of Despair. That is the team assembled to kick ass. The team won, with all four members standing strong in four turns. It was not my highest scoring run. I've had a higher scoring one on stream. So, you didn't miss the, the current highest score I have rocking. And these were the companions who joined me. Scam Artist, Big Green, Blut Angel, and I Was Here Once. So named because I recruited that character before going to face the Emperor. Uh, as it turns out, when uh, you have a smaller party, a coterie, if you will, they do level quicker if you can survive the trials and tribulations. And that party absolutely did. It was good times. Good times. We have some gameplay of our own to take care of in this broadcast. Just thought I would share that real quick. So this will be run 10-ish. Officially, in the record books. When I cut this up and put it on YouTube. Glory Level 9 has been conquered, courtesy of the Scam Artist. The challenges I ran were non-existent. I didn't run a single challenge, and it was... I definitely could tell some of the AI doing derpy things. It was great. I make an enemy bleed. I stealth. They run around a bit and bleed. It was good times. Glory level 10 just says enemies are tougher. You encounter more beasts. Uh, per the achievements list, there are 15 glory levels. At least 15 that have achievements. So that's something to keep in mind. I didn't 100% the first game, and I don't anticipate 100%ing this game. What we're going to do is uh, actually escalate the difficulty level. Because I want to see what the hell Hard and Master have for us. There are no descriptions available to us for what they do. Maybe they'll pop up when we actually start those difficulty levels, and I'd like to fucking see what's up. We are going to play on base default level uh, and see how Hard compares to the normal experience, if we can even remember that. As for challenge modifiers, I figure if there's going to be a time where we uh, maybe take care of a small team, why not have it now? We do other things like rotating skills, burly enemies, and permanent death. We'll just do a small team. We'll keep it small. That means that uh, only three name redemptions are really going to work for this broadcast. You have been warned. 
I'm going to roll with the Fiendling here. That's my next one on the list. Uh, we certainly made plenty of use of Fiendlings. We still have several more to go. I'm looking forward to the Vampire one. I have, uh, I have uh, a goodly appreciation of drink blood. Even if I don't much care for vampires. Okay. Let's roll a new team name. And stop. Assailants of the Uninvited? How about we just truncate that to the Uninvited? Our founding character shall be... Agitar? Cool. Stat block-wise, I don't really know what the hell you can end up with. Let's see. I'd prefer one or the other emphasized here and not both. That gives me... That gives me a nice amount of AP, but you don't really have killing power. Unless I just burn him to death. That's an issue. Too slow. Good enough. Physical it is. We'll have two skill books, a shitty weapon, and 100 gold. Let's get on with it. He said the thing! I can't believe he said the thing! look at this set. Dragon's Breath, huh? I thought... I thought what was happening here was that I was, uh, I was gonna lean into physical, but the books disagreed. No wonder you were split. I should have waited to choose the damn weapon. Anyway. I like Conjure Tendril for pulling an enemy next to me. Righteous Outburst is going to be nice in order to give me, like, a flat bonus to damage. And also, like, apply shield to caster. Unfortunately, I can't fucking cast it. And that's going to be an issue. Dragon's Breath, I'm not going to be able to cast that. I'm not going to be able to cast any of these. I'm going to need two more points of wisdom. That's kind of a... Kind of a problem. I can't even use one of my starting moves. All right. Well. Just get the show on the road, yeah? I might go for this shop. Look for a wisdom potion. Grab this event along the way. Then, like, swap over to this event, then that event. Then that event looks like I'm going to dodge the one elite that's on the board here. That's okay. Let's get started. You can't save those books to sell. Like, they, they automatically get applied to the starting character. Also, for stream's sake... Make sure that volume level is okay. Cool. What do you have? Sudden gust repealing salvo? I'm gonna miss that damn smoke bomb that the gem starts with. Get over here! Man, it's gonna be weird healing up the full HP after a fight. I'm here for it. Choose one blank armor. We're gonna take the 12 MP there. And I'm gonna take the two magic damage, one agility. That... Almost equalizes that with physical damage. Oh yeah, full heal. Wow. Nuts. What a time to be alive. Howdy, howdy. Can't reach. Pass.
Uh huh. Spirit projection. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> How did that deal 26 damage? Well, I see. 10 plus 5 is 15. Doubled to 30. And then reduced for some tough... I... <laughs> like... <laughs> K, We suffered a loss. Like, the fuck was I gonna do about that chat room? <laughs> <laughs> Stuff. You have two AP? Holy shit, you do. I'm seven gold short because I didn't get a reward, but I can sell that dagger. Yeah, we need some, uh, we need, we need, uh, we need a slab here, a hard, turgid, tumescent, burgeoning, bulgy, hulking, green slab. And that's you, Asthma. All right, well, anyway. Sometimes you get crit for 26 fucking damage in the second fight. And that was more than this character's max HP, so, you know. Boop. Phasing. Could land anywhere. Discount big bastard. Uh, the character limit is generous. I, I couldn't say whether it's that generous. Am I willing to just end up next to that barrel? I'd rather you pop that than, like, hit me for damage. I could have stepped there and, like, reached in. Give you the old reach around. Oh, you can't reach. I suppose that would complicate things. Here. Harlan E. Okay. Well, we'll find out. Good buddy, we'll find out. I'm in the mood for research. I guess? Heat. Heat. Let's rename first Discount Big Bastard. It does fit, Carvine. Asva could take that name. Harlan E. I'm just gonna go crit damage. You can't make me. I'm just gonna go HP. You can't make me. <laughs> I'm just gonna go MP. Fine. <laughs> Discount big bastard. That actually hits the character limit on the nose, Carmine. I was starting to type out numbers there to see because we've seen it has a fairly generous like character limit. You we've hit it on the nose. Discount Big Bastard. Bargain Bin. Big Bargain Bastard? Hmm. Splash.
Attention all Kmart shoppers. If you knock me back five tiles, then you knock me back five tiles. Double burn. Multi burn. Goodbye. Step on in there, bud. Take a hit. Ow! My bloods! Oh, you are out of MP. That's okay. I didn't even start the regeneration. It's all good. This is hard difficulty. Okay. I mean, we did lose a fight, so let's let's not get carried away here. Take this event. Fucking fiendling, are you magic? Are you? Are you? Are you? There's just a lot happening. Actually, I didn't even notice you had four skills. That was a choice that you made. No one can... can take that choice away from you. You made that. It's yours, you get to keep it. Oh, Noxious Swipe, I know what that is. Get out of here. Green skill, charge! Read it. Yeah, that's our whole team. Shut up. Champions of the hidden truth. They both have one AP. Bye, buddy. Hope you have a good one. That plus 10 is going to do a lot for me right now in my current condition. Ah. Just continue to try to fight that it's going to be uh, wisdom. Just... Refuse... Refuse? You bought Mortal Glory too? All right. Hope you have fun with the experience.
Random character gets plus five vitality? I'm in. Harlan... Harlan E. doesn't get it, though, even though the event mentions Harlan E. No, discount Big Bastard drinks all the fucking water. Just dunks that face running. Oh. Treasure. Navigander. Green Relic? Uh... I'm liking the uh, notion of... I'm actually going to take this Mana Stone. Green Weapon? And another Green Weapon. Ooh. Okay. Let's grab that claw. That goes on to you. You won't have enough mana to use that noxious swipe anymore. That's okay. Just get it off the board. Here, we're going to tentatively... I guess... Pick up a magic weapon. I fucking suppose. Sigh. Even though I am definitely investing in strength. That also gives 20 HP. I don't feel too bad about grabbing that. Been time. I know, right, Kibitz? Oh boy. Am I willing to fight another big bastard? Well, let's let's do a little bit of science here, chat room. We gain 150 gold, but we're gonna fight a familiar in the next fight. Now, does does this gear up? Does not. The unit has been generated already. Okay. Something else I thought about uh, while I was uh, on my own, but I didn't test, was the notion of, like, being, like, putting units from the active team into your roster before you go into an event to influence, like, if it's going to be an event that targets an individual, if you can make it just target one particular individual by removing everyone else from the active team, or whether it could, like, hit anyone, like, even on the roster. I don't know if I want to give the squad a buff. Because there's more of you, but... Yeah, sure. Hmm. 2v3 and they get a buff. You know, I have already lost a fight this match. I, I probably shouldn't be so gung-ho to do this shit. Since, on account of me having lost a fucking fight already... But science, science is a uh, a cruel, many-tiered mistress, or some shit like that. No kill. All right, bargain bin bastard. You have hazard protection. You have death defiant, and you have piercing resolve. Half your damage is a piercing. One, two, three... Huh? I only have three movement, though. Boo! I was thinking I might, like, tug. Tug the foe, big bastard! Let's press T to move tooltips there. Yup, club. <laughs> okay. Okay, the cyclone... <laughs> The cyclone was manageable. That could have been worse. <laughs> I was concerned about that cyclone shock. Ow. Bye. See you when you get back! <laughs> you are able to blow up that barrel with Blessed Bolt. Blessed be! Blessed be. Blessed be. 
Blessed be. Discount big bastard, no! I know we'll get the challenge done. Get some cruddy armor for our efforts. Yeah, I don't think I'll wear any of this. Green weapon. The four agility is better than the one wep uh, one AP, because it gives me the one AP, but I do get Conjured Tendril from that. It's pretty nice. It doesn't consume a turn. Gives my enemies a good tug. Good old Jolly Tug. You tempt me, game. No, Kibitz. We're on max, bud. Everyone's fully healed. I'm playing on hard difficulty. There are no glory levels enabled. I think you spent too much time listening to Harley. Everyone's back. Walking through a small village, you notice an active amateur fighting ring looking for new competitors. We can participate to give Discount Big Bastard plus two to main stats. Hell yeah! Discount big bastard! Lorgan and Gorg. See, I have seen more formidable rodents than you, Nui! Ah, oh, this arena again. I've got to say, I really do enjoy the termite box that was a, that was a big help in the, the solo gaming that I did I cannot I cannot define exactly how many enemies I saw with shit like procurement order just like get the fuck out of here with that please Yeah, no, no barrels, please. Please do be. Please do be barreling. Presumably you're gonna like step here or here. Oh, you're just gonna fucking walk through the fire. Okay. I don't give a shit. I don't give a fuck. Howdy. Bye. Reach out and touch a bastard today. <laughs> Support your local bastard economy. Ow, crit. 6% chance. You're desperate. It makes sense. Green skill conjured bramble. Fuck yeah. Coming again to say the motherfucker day, yeah, conjure bramble. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Have a buff. Turns out I, I'm more fine with them having buffs than I am with debuffs. Relief and Brawler's Blessing for plus seven strength. Understood. What's your moves? Okay. 
so nice to get a full heal in between fights again. Ugh, it's been so long. <laughs> it really has. Good times. Good times. Good times. Howdy. Mending warm up? Does that take a turn? No, it does not. And a green weapon? A conjured tendril, a crippling blow. Splash zone. Eh. Don't think I'll use any of these. I'll grab that. See, this event locks me into this shop where I could presumably grab a third gladiator. If I felt so inclined, it would be my... I can only have an active roster of three per the one challenge modifier I have selected. I have 838 knockouts in total over the course of my career. Alternatively, I could go shopping for skills. Weapons, armor... I would, I would like to see some skills. I would. I would. I'm fine with seeing some gladiators too, I guess. Or I could just buy some potions. Some buffs. Leave the third gladiator for later. I think the highest they can go up to is level six. In the shop on level one. If my experience remembers true. That's right, Def Heaven. More glory. Um, only one challenge modifier, which is limiting the size to three, and uh, no glory levels. I'm just playing on hard difficulty to see what it's like. We've already taken a loss, as a matter of fact. I got, uh, I got critted to hell. Just, <coughs> just fucking annihilated. Four AP, huh? Back we go. No bastard is bigger. Lorger. You get back to your fucking star location. <laughs> oh, shit. No one wants to see you. through the park one day in the merry merry month of May whatever I'll take that shrug level up holy fuck we can get a uh, we can get a melee attack here Perk swipe, not as necessary. When I get a full heal after every fight. Ugh. Let's see about some potions. And some skills. What you got for me? Mana Fiend, Tackle, Special Delivery. Some is a random barrel on target location. 
telekinetic blast. How about armor? <laughs> really want me to have this fucking magic damage, huh? <laughs> I'm just like still like kicking and screaming and fighting like no Harlan E will not do magic now but it's just <laughs> the future refused to change That's right, Dev Evan. We, we listened to some Harlan Ellison uh, to start the broadcast. I uh, had to get in touch with my Harlan Ellison roots. Uh, my, my, my voice for him over the years has morphed into fucking Starscream and then just sort of lackadaisical. I had to... I had to re-embrace him. I even redeemed a hate usage myself so I could go into it after the fact. Ahem. <clears throat> Hate! Let me tell you how much I've come to hate you since I began to live. There are 387.44 million miles of printed circuits and wafer-thin layers that fill my complex. If the word hate was engraved in each nano angstrom of those hundreds of millions of miles, it would not equal one one billionth of the hate I feel for humans, those micro-instant. For you. Hate! Hate! Thanks, Harlan. You go back in the box. No! <laughs> give me a fourth action point there. And give me two vitality. <laughs> Damn it, Death Evan. Oh, Royal Goblin. Been a while, bud. Time for him to fucking troll me with all of his bullshit. Oh, a hasty teleport that sent that enemy to the abyss instead of being sent right next to me? Imagine that. What a time to be alive. Whoa. This is, this is what this guy looks like when he's not souped up, huh? The only other time I've seen this royal goblin, he could fucking clone himself. So I'm like, whoa. <laughs> All right. Cool. That's not so bad. Imagine that, like, <laughs> glory level one. You might be onto something. What's your barrel sending potential for? You got a tendril of your own. Inner dies. So you give yourself a charge of unleashed pressure, K. Okay. Get over here, discount big bastard's gonna take you to the house. I guess. I mean, if you want, uh, fine. Cool. That's not a kill. Okay. He said amount of damage before you went. Boop. Yeah, I did walk into that. I'm sorry, did you say that you wanted to be plagued? Oh. You're plagued. You got a life leech. Damn it. <laughs> I'll just crit you. Get out of here.
Give me some bones. Discount Big Bastard with the bones. Secure Strike for Shielded. Exposing Assault to apply Vulnerable, which is a pretty nice setup. We'll pick up the Secure Strike for now. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Ow. Oh. I know my route. I will promptly forgive my route, but for now I know my route. Let's go get him. Harlan E and Discount Big Bastard, 2v3. Have your buff. Oh, for a gray weapon? Yeah, that's... That's worth my fucking time. Oh, I mean, it's really a 3v3. Look at little adorable Dustbone over here. I love him. He's great. Five AP. Hmm. I was not expecting a dive, dive, dive. Looks like uh, Kazumi here could grapple. No. Misread that. We're safe. You could hit me with a fire starter. Yeah, that got super fired. And now you live in the super fire. You chose to dwell within the super fire. I mean, I guess. What's your AP? Five? 14 damage. Hmm. This doesn't go well, does it? I could repel to keep you away from there to not obscure a big bastard on his way forward, doubtlessly. Do what you must, crit. I'll crit too. Keep that barrel between me and the dryad. Drone riot. Drone riot? What the fuck? <laughs> 25! No! <laughs> Stop riding! No! I think I am going to, uh, when I, I get some time memory, uh, remove the setup I had to, to save myself. Right. Another 10! No! That's a hundred? Fuck! I'm gonna remove the setup that has all, like, the gifted at one subs bundled up into one to save me. Uh, I think, I, I, I think I'll have them set to be individual again. I'm not clicking 35 times, though, on all this. <laughs> I'm not- you, you're not allowed to riot that much. <laughs> I'm not rewarding this behavior. You calm the hell down. I mean, look at these fucking names. We have Intro- Introspective 90, Dub Bins, The Azure, Etoile Lyon, Metal Hero Regulus Absalon, Fairbrook, Cassis, Maxwell Damage, Plump Helmet Punk. <gasps> We're calling out these lurkers. Praise Yevon, Mikey Moe, Pink Onion, Flurpin, Look Aurora, Snow Dub, Raven Blackwing, Aten or Aten Rip, Gaming Myth, Kabitz, Pure Black Haze, Argit Lamb Papa, Invasor, Psychopathic Nasus, Eru Yaru, Don Tullinen, Dur Azre, Cured Shan, Legendary Marvin, Mehos, Tommy Star, True Neat Neutral, Ev Genius, Ligiag, Do Care, Rune GM, Icomon, 
Twitch has made so much money right now because of you, Mr. Gibberish. We're going to open up an addendum to the Scrooge McDuck vault. I don't even know how I cited that many names. It's incredible. That's too many names. Fucking drones. I don't have that many staplers. <laughs> Hold still, damn you. I'm going to have to build a punishment sphere. Fuck. So anyway, this is deeply upsetting. <laughs> How could you do this to me? Haven't I shown you the world? Haven't I given you everything? And I am repaid. Repaid by having money poured upon my carcass. 35. You've gifted a total of 100. Do you know how many that is? If you said 100, I guess that's true. But also, what the fuck? Mind control. Think about it. The vault was open. Oh. Shit. You're, you're onto something there, Death Evan. Randomly cloned unit for my team in exchange for two green skills. You can't have. You can't have me. You'd be gone. Look at this adorable bone face. Face made out of bones. Bone faces. kind of skills you got? Hmm. Lesson B. One agility, huh? One AP. You want cake? Well, <laughs> you are the master of your destiny. <laughs> you must be a hunter-gatherer, or gatherer-hunter, if you prefer, and acquisition the cake. Blaming me for getting into pen and paper role-playing games? I guess you could do that. That sounds like a lack of accountability. <laughs> cool, I hope you've enjoyed telling stories. Stories by yourself and stories with others. Embracing a creative escapism, letting your juices flow. Like mine after being paid that much. <laughs> well, I'll receive it eventually. Soon, TM. I love it. Yes, I'm glad you've uh, glad you've enjoyed yourself. I have occasionally enjoyed myself too. I will use this money when I do eventually receive it on something for me, because it always is for me. Always. I'll probably buy some yogurt, maybe like a hibachi steak bowl. It'll be great. Some people tell you that all their all their like receiving cash goes to like improving like the stream quality. No, it goes to improving my tummy quality. <laughs> but my tummy matters more than this broadcast, damn it. Rift Three Galaxies game? Woof! Get into Rifts for your first system. If uh, if Rifts is what inspires you, then yeah. But that one is uh, it's got some logistics involved. Let's get that barrel out of the way. We do. We've got Discount Big Bastard right here, named by Carmine. Good. Bad. Oh, you rooted my boy, my son. You rooted my son. We got a great attack angle here. What's your AP? One. Gotta shove this barrel out of the way. Prepare for uh, Johnny here. Johnny? Oh, that's Glomney. Sorry. Glomney. 
Reed's name tag. Glomney, yes, yes, Glomney. My bad, my bad, Glomney, yeah. So what do you do, Glomney? I kill you, hopefully. You disrespectful bastard. Hmm. Well, I could resolve that. Boop. Just clean that up. Heal my three hit points. Go get him. Summon v summon. Summon wins. Ah! The fire is spreading! This would be so much worse if I did not get a full heal. What kind of, uh, what kind of stories are you telling now these days? You got anything lined up? Made RPG? 13th Age, Warhammer Fantasy Roleplay. Iron Sworn. Some Battletech shit. Procurement order. <laughs> no. Forgot to make use of mind control. Ever forget to mind control someone before chat room? Is it just me? Probably just me. That's right. Edge of the Empire or one of the other Final Final Fantasy Flight games. Uh, like systems. I do like their dice and the mechanics thereof. Blades of the Dark. Stranger. Let me introduce myself. I am a giver of things. I am also a taker of things. Would you bargain with me? This is Paul Atreides. This is the Guiza Tadarak. <laughs> the fulcrum <laughs> cannot give without taking and cannot take without giving. Ah, gotcha. Got some bone shards. We got a ball. Oh, the sacred box of termites. What do you want for the termites? A random negative perk. Bone shards for one skeleton aiding the enemy team and decrease agility by 12 on a random character for the telekinetic cow. I do like that box of termites. I'm not willing to take a negative perk for that. I'll uh, I'll fight a skelly, bro. Termites, best. It's one of the best items. It provides plus ten protection for the unit wearing it, and uh, at the start of battle, there are no environmental objects, none. Just erases them all. Now, like. They could, like, get spawned in by, like, like map conditions, but, ugh, it's so great. People just come in with procurement orders and you say, absolutely fucking lutely not. I, I do not have the time to deal with this shit. I'm gonna replace mind control. I've used it before, but uh, Bone Shards does synergize the Conjured Bramble. A little irresponsible with that. Enemy gets a beast character? Blue skill would be nice. You've already got some skeleton assistants. You have one AP, three of two. How hard is the beast? You know what? Fuck it. 2v5. Let's. Uh, excuse me, 3v5. Let's fucking go! That's right, train. Let's fucking go! Excuse me, how much damage does that beast do? Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Reading. <laughs> Reading and you. How much damage do you do? Hmm. 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 You just... Quit think you're fucking slow. How many enemies will we try to yank into this pit? We're about to fucking find out, chat room, because holy fuck. 
That is... that is some number. Five range. So you can... Uh, one, two, three, four, five. I stand there, I can get God. I think shooting the fire this turn ain't worth it. I will bide my time. Big Bastard's chance. Big Bastard will also bide his time. That barrel. That barrel could interfere with everything. I have half a mind to charge the damn barrel, but the random debuff could be stunning me. Aye. Okay. Cobbling together your own stuff. Hey. Taking bits and pieces of systems to craft your own thing for uh, your group to tell stories with? I've been there. I get it. That could be very rewarding. But also onerous. You don't have enough MP for that. I want this barrel dead. that part of my body <coughs> it was holding me back I guess oh <coughs> my everything <laughs> help lightning I probably have to deal with this summon using techniques that I don't quite know the answer to yet but it might involve crying you have so much MP as well I'm not gonna Got that enemy at least. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Pretty sure we're gonna burn to death though. Maybe we will. No, don't provide more MP. Okay. Ow! Fuck! No! The blood! <laughs> this bastard with the lightning! Damn you! Damn you! <laughs> Damn you for trailing blood everywhere! You are a skeleton! Ah, fuck. Well. You look at that skeleton having trailed blood everywhere. The, the ultimate, the ultimate. Like, that's what got the damn troll killed. I might have been able to hunker back and regenerate more. This skeleton also absolutely has enough MP to fling that even more. And that's going to be another 19 points of damage before damage reduction? Fuck. I had, uh, I had con- you know, I'd obviously, like, uh, maybe she did damage? No, I was going to walk away. No, I definitely have to- I gotta resolve this enemy, and it's a good thing that I do have some physical damage at this point, since this character is spent. I got a combustion, and I got a combustion. That's what I got. I got combustion and 10 physical damage and a dream. That's gonna be slow going. Hmm. 
measuring out attack range. I was hoping to get a knock back into the wall there before she drink blood. All that cleared up, huh? I don't think that blocks line of sight. You're gonna burn to death. Your final attack on me. Get the hell out of here. Shouldn't have line of sight of me if I'm standing here. Would it be better to stand there? I think this is fine. Have to find out. Cool. Okay. Close. But I mean, we definitely greeted that. We, we had a, an extra skeleton on top of giving the enemy a beast character. That was absolute greed. If we had lost, we wouldn't have gotten a fucking thing. But we won. So we got everything. That's how that works. I, I did the math. <laughs> I ran the numbers. I see you, game. I see what you're trying to do, but I insist. I insist I will do physical damage. I insist. I'm... I'm, <laughs> I'm committed to this life. He says, wielding a magic stick. I refuse. I will no longer wield that magic stick now. Never mind the enchanted plate there. Damn it. You've got to believe. I'm gonna hold on to this book for now. We get a free frozen orb! A free frozen orb from the government? Shit. On the first turn of battle, enemies of this unit only get one move. It can be advantageous, it can also be disadvantageous. Depends on, uh, your... your needs. This fight will take this chain, the, t the events, the elite, that, that, and we'll pick up a shop at the end? I think so. One of these two. Just hang left. Thinking about stopping by a shop and picking up a third gladiator. Nah, we'll keep it going, just us two. Just the two of us. Stormy season and patchy terrain. I can make them tougher. Which will be plus seven all their attributes. I can Kashiko here with 21 wisdom, 25 magic damage. And that consume skill. Hmm. Which was unlocked. From like nine to ten. Also, hey tornadoes. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Mom, they're level seven and we're level five. Hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot that. Ooh. Much swifter now. Much swifter. I think I wanted to keep that staff on still for the extra hit points. I 
Critical chances doubled for that skill. Great. How long do these tornadoes last? Great. Well, we can outspeed them. And we can separate the Umibozu from the troll. Yeah. That sounds good. Get this barrel out of here? No. Just gotta lurk here in the shadows. Oh, that's right, you only have one AP to start off. Aha! You can't do shit. I got lightning. Go get him, kid. Maybe not. <laughs> yep. Just gotta... You do what you must. I'm not going to be able to reach to attack. There's that in the way. An arena obstacle. An obstacle. I shall continue to hide. From the tornadoes. I suspect you'll take the shot. As in, get shot. Hmm. Not a whole lot of movement happened there. You also have an ass load of MP to do what must be done. Kinda walled in there, I think. I feel. Five, three. Okay. Just swap this away from me. I mean, that was a lot of work to get to me. You are to be commended, question mark? <laughs> It's fine, it's fine, we're good. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine, no problems here. None. Eep. You don't really have anywhere to eep to, so I need you to send that barrel far, far away. When what you're fighting is not the enemy team, but the... <laughs> but the shit. The tornado's gonna be around for two more turns. They're about to fade. Fading fast. Goodbye. We're clear. Let's get on with the killing. How you doing, bud? Uh-huh. 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 Like, aha, I dealt three damage, noob. And like, you did. You did. You did.
Good reposition. Good reposition. That was a worthwhile usage of that skill. Refreshment. Mentos better. <laughs> uh, if only some of us had wisdom. But we forsook that path. I start. Oh boy. I always wanted to start. Pick me, pick me. Fucking song. I just love that yo-yo quality of send it back. Well. Uh-huh. Ooh, petrifying touch. Sorry about that skill. Yeah, 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 that's exactly what it says on the turn, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Maybe could have routed that better. It's okay. I will get you, little man. Discount Big Bastard is on the case. Maybe I won't get you. I could use a third person now. Did I say something about changing this weapon at some point and, like, back to this HP and then I didn't? Eh, we'd use the extra physical damage when we run out of our cool skills, I guess. Whatever. Hey, you got this. Thanks, buddy. Evening, traveler. Might I be interested in one of my magical items? I could see myself parting with one of them, a rare fossil. The end of this unit's turn, steal a buff from a surrounding unit. Anytime this unit's skills gain a charge, they gain another charge, and this unit gains... Ah, I'm good. I'm good, madam. I thank you, though, for the opportunity. Blue armor. So, MP is an issue for you. Not, I have not forgotten this. I want to give you that strength. You're going to lose the ability to utilize that conjured bramble. Give you five agility and two wisdom. So another blue armor piece here, which could have changed my pick. It'll be fine. Fourteen protection and seven vitality. Thirteen protection, three vitality. Twenty-four HP, twelve MP. This right here. This is uh, that'll that'll take care of that MP issue, and you know, provide an ass load of HP and protection. And finally, this relic. 
A lightning stone, a holy sash, and a rare fossil. I want to pick up that lightning stone. We can perhaps attempt a plan or three with that. Just sell that row of gear. his head. Okay. I was thinking about whether or not I wanted to take that for the Elite and also open up that event chain. We'll take that for the Elite. Here's Andy. Andy's our biggest fan. Andy's here to join us in this fight. Bromda here. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. 14 agility, 13 action points. Oh boy. You got six. Your skills, though, are pretty eh. This angel is. 23 flat magic damage with a repealing salvo for a plus 5. And then a just 17 physical damage to follow up. Andy is pretty inconsequential here, but will be a body. That's for sure. And this 3v4. It's just kind of a matter of who does Brom do want to kill. Excuse me. Yeah. How far does Bromda want to move, taking one piercing damage after every step? We'll, we'll find out together. Because I ain't stopping that shit. Mm -hmm. Fuck, I got. Seven knockback distance, three knockback distance. Yeah. 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 Times like this, you're like... Eh. Well, even like a smoke bomb wouldn't do any good. Bromda, again, can just go wherever the fuck Bromda wants. <laughs> it's gonna hurt. If only we had the cautious attack tick box on. Cautious start. You'd only have 5 AP, and you could only deal half damage to me. All these fucking barrels around here, too. I don't want to step up and vaporize, you know, little Andy. Just swat that away. Right, we have the frozen orb! Right, the frozen orb! Ha ha! <laughs> How could I forget? I got distracted by 13 action points. Behold! That could have been our time to swivel around and somehow deal... Yeah, no. <laughs> but it could have been... <laughs> this was our moment. Oh, he got slowed! Nicely done, Boyne. Hell yeah. Get dunked on, nerd! <laughs> Fuck your 13 action points. That was the correct choice. And everyone's proud of you. Especially me.
Let's do a normal attack. Nice crit. I mean, okay. You did well. Glad I got these bones. The, them bones, them bones gonna walk around. Them bones, them bones gonna walk around. Them bones, them bones gonna walk around. Now hear the word of the Lord. Hmm. He does deal double damage versus summon units. So, you know. It's the way to go. Okay. You're still slowed for a turn. Ha <laughs> ha! Alas, because we actually got the kill there. It's not the first time that's happened to me where me getting a kill has opened me up to retaliation. <laughs> like, oh, fuck. Hey, hey, you calm down with the crits, Mr. 30%. Hey, hey, you calm down with the crits, Mr. 21%. Am I going to regret using that early? Because the, the, the more HP I'm missing, the more I can heal. I don't have to engage in this fight right now. Oh shit, I do. You outspeed me. That was dumb. I'm dumb. I'm fucking dumb. So dumb. Charge! No knockback. Okay, crit. <laughs> Get out of here. Thanks, discount big bastard. This skill is just kind of like... <sighs> you have to be adjacent. You have to be willing to accept a stun. <sighs> Like, we did see an item that would allow me to, like, restore charges, like, to things, so I could actually get a charge instead of having to deal a knockout. I'm still kind of like, hey, you know, you know. Or it's just not control units. That's, that's always a blast when you don't control units. We'll pick it up. Maybe we'll do a thing with it. Maybe. Would like to see some other purple skills there, but, uh... So it goes. Bro, we just saw each other. I just beat you down. This is why I didn't want to start this event, Shane. <sighs> Fine. Well, I mean, okay. <laughs> Twist my fucking arm. Okay. We'll see about getting this done with a third character. There are other things I want to have equipped at this moment in time, but okay. Welcome back, Andy. 2v5. We're, uh... in a wild arena.
la 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 lined up just so for me. I'd have to step into some fire to do the grapple here. The dragon breath. I can stand there and do it. some damage out. You got a quick heal. You do, you do, you do. Gotta watch out for spawn tornado that could fling me into hell. Be three tiles. That wouldn't fling me into a pit from this position. Or that position. Six AP on Andy. If I stand here, one, two, three, four, five, you could definitely reach me. Okay. But it wouldn't be in a pit. Cool. Oh, I love it. Don't love that. Rooted in the fire. And Andy's one tile too far away for me to pull in to this pit with a conjure tendril. You're stuck. Unfortunately, this would only end up pulling there. But it allows me to do some damage. Told Andy here, who is not a summon. Andy, you cheating son of a bitch! <laughs> Forgot he had stubborn. There we go. Thanks, Skelly Bro. Skelly bro, no! Skelly bro! My bro. My bro! Who's better to attack here? You. Crit flashes on the screen. Everyone cries. Everyone cries. So we won a 2v5. Both of us are level 6 now. A purple rang for our trouble. The Jade Seal, plus 4 AP, plus 4 crit chance, plus 4 protection. It's pretty nice. Plus 4 fucking action points. Okay. Strength, I say, damn you! Strength! Strength! We definitely use some more vitality. 
Yeah, let's pick up plus four vitality. Strength. Vitality. Could have picked up the plus two agility there for an extra action point. Oh well. Elite time. I was hoping for a challenge. Oh no, procurement order. No! Can't make tooltips disappear on this screen. Up to 10 extra burls. Lightning, fuck my life. Lightning storm. Sacred blade. Yes, this is on hard difficulty, definitely. One active challenge, player's team size limited to three, no glory levels or anything. I wanted to see what hard difficulty actually entailed, because there isn't a description. It's nice to get a full heal after every fight. I mean, we have lost a battle. This guy, by the way, looks gross. Like, 40 physical damage? Get the fuck out of here with that. Sacred Blade has an otherworldly blade. After performing a melee attack, that'll be charged up. There'll be two shitty flies. I'm looking at a lightning storm here and another sacred blade. At least that attack sucks. And then you, you have 34 physical damage and 27 magic damage. Why? <laughs> You're reckless. That explains it. But there's a pit. And when there's a pit, there's a chance. fucking elf in the lightning storm. <laughs> what? Summons low-level units from all corpses to aid your team. How dare you summon a fly from my bony bro? How darest thou? That's my bro. You can't just go summoning flies from a skeleton. Skeleton. Apparently you fucking can. Skeleton. Some bullshit. Well, anyway. I need you to move into advantageous positions so I can punish you. In the name of the moon. That'll work. Fighting evil by moonlight. Winning love by daylight. Gonna send you straight to Hades. He is the one named Discount Big Bastard. <laughs> <laughs> He is the one. They just can't pick bastard. Yeah. What? These kids say they don't do a great job of making clones of themselves, even though I suppose that they're, they're only at 68% intelligence and not maxed out. <laughs> If you're willing to spend a turn on that. I mean, maybe, maybe, maybe. maybe. 
It's not a no. All right. Let's go do this fight and then grab ourselves a third character. That'll that'll fill out our team. Wizard. Does not need to teleport in to do bullshit. Has vile rain. Fine, wizard. Fine. But just teleport in next turn, though you don't have any more juice. That's good. You got three AP with a bull charge. Tubby here. <laughs> Please. Help. Pestilent bolt, that's pretty nice. Meteor. Fuck off. Get it out of the way. Boop. 11 damage on that wizard. Yeah, 17 physical damage reduced by my toughness to 11. Damn, wizard. All right, then. That's not gonna kill. Hold up. Still didn't kill. One, two hit points, not one. I'm counting on you, Crackles. Be the hero I need you to be, damn it. I need a hero! <laughs> Holding out for a hero. Sneak. Whenever you gave a perk to everyone. Damn it. Alright, at least you used the crit on that. Oh. Hmm. Awkward. That'll do. Damn Meteor did all that. Woo. Big ass fucking armor! Lowers my fucking health and MP! It's okay. We'll solve this soon, TM. As long as I don't go to the wrong shop. Who's coming on board? It's you! Congratulations, Jolmdm, Tina. It's you! You're here! You have magic damage in spades. Congratulations. And fucking grants. You have a lightning? Hmm. Hmm. You see, I, I, I have moves that apparently I need to do. I have crimes in mind. Crimes in mind. Crimes in mind. <laughs> I have crimes in mind so early in the morning. You only have two AP, we'll, uh, we'll figure it out. That's right, the crime song. I want to crime, crime. I want to crime, 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 crime. What we're picking up is right here, the splitting mirror. So here's what's gonna have. Oh, fuck. Now I did this right. So, skills with charges have plus one charge. 
evil twin starts with a charge. Summon a clone of target enemy to aid your team. Splitting mirror. When this unit summons unit, summon an extra copy nearby. The main stats of the summons are lowered by 40%. Hear me out, Deaf Heaven. What if? <laughs> now we will be stunned, but if we could get a curse ward on somehow, we could block that stun. There's a lot of mayhaps in here, you know, like, ah, very possibly, potentially, it could happen. Alternatively, we could mind control, but I mean, come on. Where's the fun in that? Mind control, ah. <laughs> yeah, there is. Cannot target boss units. <laughs> Says so on the 10. It is forbidden. The dev thought of it. That fucker, I know. <laughs> everything. Everything has already been considered. Alright, I need you to have, like... Here's the thing, right? So Splitting Mirror might have to, like, sit in the back burner. Like, I spent several hundred gold on it, but I might have to put it in timeout to allow Jill to just be able to use this one fucking time. There's another evil twin skill. If only you could learn duplicate skills, but instead you have team player. I'm not inclined to pick up another skill here. I'm thinking about re-rolling to look at some other skills. Yeah. I'm gonna save these items. I might save this to utilize. I'd like to put that on. Obviously this. I don't think I'm mind controlling with this with this squad. Secure Strike, I could replace that Repealing Thrust now. That's 14, plus 10 is 24, that's 32. It's not much of an upgrade, though. I might be better off selling, although that's Bly Shielded. Shield's pretty nice. So yeah, we'll save these items, I guess. I'm not going to equip that again. Save these items. Go back to the shop. Give me a reroll. Throw rock? I love throw rock. Oh, you. You temptress. <laughs> I love throw rock. Harmonious discharge? I... I uh, really uh, came to appreciate that skill in the run that I did before starting this broadcast where I cleared up glory level 9. Uh, because this can hit stealth bastards. This randomly hits up to two targets within range. You don't gotta target them. If you've got someone who's got big, big strength and big wisdom, you can have yourself a rip-roaring good time. We're not really a rock throwing squad, you know? I just gotta. I'd have to drop this. I'd have to drop that. I don't really have the MP to drop this shit. I want you to have the MP to actually throw a conjured bramble. I'm gonna have to. I could have to give you the mana stone. Like that? I kind of put you in a bind, but we are so transitioning you away from magic shit. My pinky swear. <laughs> there. Yes, this is superior. But we'll keep this for the extra agility. Well, we don't need that if you have 4 AP right now. So we can put that on so you have a bunch of extra damage. And then one day we'll put on the splitting mirror I bought when you don't need the 4 AP any longer. 
or maybe the lightning stone. If, you know, we get like a lightning storm or that huge ass thunderbolt. But this ring. Is it worth picking up th throw rock? Think. Think I'm gonna leave the rock o alone. Oh, that hurts to say. Ugh, I'm a rock. But my rock, I love, I love rock. As in throw rock. No, it's an investment for the future. Worst case, we'll give up that throws an orb. All right, let's go. The barbarians of rebirth. Holy shit! This will be my first time with Big Slitherer. Undine, Troll, Umibozu, and the giant Slitherer. Yeah, I haven't I haven't fought this boss before. Let's have a look. Seven charges of heal self per battle. The vampiric gloves. Blight mail. Damage by a melee attack, apply a random debuff to the attacker in Mage Staff. Just has Splash Zone on it. We have Visionary. Every time this unit uses a skill, is replaced by a new random skill. And Careful for a 5% max HP heal. The racial skill is Detonate Magic. Uh, buff and debuff Destroyer. Heals 6 piercing damage for each. And the starting skill array, uh, before Visionary takes hold, is Lightning Drain life, sudden gust, and spread misery. What will happen after? <laughs> Something. Yeah. Kaz Thalthu. Holy shit, that is a giant slayer. <laughs> Holy fuck. I didn't know they grew them that big. <laughs> Mind you, this crank calls. About how big of a boy are you? Oh. Right. Right, that's the that's the armor I was saving to provide the one extra skill charge. But it's okay, because we start with a charge because of the charge crystal. I did forget about the fact that, that armor did that, though. I'm tired. Yeah, that means we could start with two charges of that. Nods emphatically. <laughs> fucking huge. Giant, even. <laughs> Lorg. Uh, I guess I could go after you. You're the fragilis. No, I think, uh, I know you're gonna heal. But let, we'll just heal all of that, no problems. Oh, no! Mana cost are reduced by 33%. No! It doesn't count the savings until you actually cast the spell. So this is actually still being counted as 11, which he can't cast at all. And so he does not qualify for the savings of being able to cast it for cheaper. That's... Yeah, mistakes in game design. Definitely not by me. That's not even me being like facetious. No, that's 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 a serious declarative statement from me. Okay. Well, that complicates things. But we can work through this, he said. That's not gonna help me block shit for damage. Ambitious, that ambitious. Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. And we crit for good measure. <laughs> I can show you the world. One, two, three. 
actually do want to pull you a tile closer. I do believe that I swat you away and go, damn it. No, I don't. Good. Fuck you! <laughs> Go fuck yourself! number there. It says 22. Well. Wait. 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 Why though? <laughs> wait. Wait a minute. Wait. Hold on. <laughs> Wind affliction. Wind affliction. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. I was like, wait. What happened? <laughs> what happened? Oh, shit. Gain a charge when a unit deal when unit deals a knockout, but... Right, you knocked out the Undine. Yeah, it is good knowledge to have. Frost Nova's neat, but I don't like how it damage scales. Rose up arms. Who's out a bunch of protection with this? That's a lot of MP, though. I put it sixty-five protection. That's 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 AI angel numbers. I love to do that shit. Just give that to you. And just sigh at the lamentation of the lost physical damage. Just have you be like some weird hybrid Harlan E. E. Then we can give you this. All skills and charges gain one charge. That means we'd have to spend a turn juicing that up. That's probably not worth doing. Let you wear that. We'll. I think we'll just shrug and sell this. That's fine for you to wear. Since this ring isn't going to help you, if I want you to be able to do your moves, I'm going to need to give you a thing. I lose out on an AP and six physical damage. But in exchange,
you will absolutely have more than enough magic <laughs> to do the conjured bramble move. Which means we can replace this and do what really matters and it's throw a fucking rock. Amen, brother. <laughs> brother. Bobette. Bobette it is. Yeah, I'm not using that. Get rid of that. Keep these two as plans. Yeah, we we put several hundred gold in that in that mirror. It's because I would like to use it, but uh having this angel with more than fucking two AP is really important. Alright, what do we got here? If I'm getting that, it's probably gonna be through potions. And stopping at this shop. Dip off, grab an elite, grab this event. I'm less keen to grab events now, because it's just gonna be Andy again going, I will I really want to fight you a third time. Here is a relic. Let us do battle. I'm like, bro, I'm good. We must engage in holy carnage, bro. It's fine. I insist. Andy has spoken. Like, okay, bro. Level 5 skeleton. Does a decent amount of damage there. It's pretty, it's pretty not bad. Pretty not bad. Turbulent. Angel here. Angel reporting. I have an ass load of HP glaciate. Ooh, that's, uh... That's notable. Glaciate with the stun. Electric touch. Mm, don't touch my... Filthy casual! Oh, only have four AP now. It's tragic. But you know what we can do? We'll throw a fucking rock. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you. Get away from me. You disgust me. <laughs> I was gonna clone him, but, uh... You know... Shit happens. <laughs> Howdy! Just had to check some uh, check some numbers there. I checked the footage, the tape, the math. That's still gonna permit you to reach uh, that body anyway, though it is covered by a tornado. I'm not entirely sure what's going to happen. You resolved it. Good, we have more tornadoes. Four, three, two, one. Blast off! <laughs> uh, no! Skelly bro! Boop. That Berserk isn't inherently bad. Like, obviously, it can cause problems, but 
this unit not being like can't be controlled, right? That's surely that's. I mean, surely it will go haywire and then under control, and that'll benefit us somehow. We won't get all glaciated and stunned. It'll be great. He said, full of confidence. Gonna be phasing until the end of days over there. Where will the triad end up next time? Let's go, Bobette. Forty nine percent crit chance. Ow. Colossal Blast, you say? Yeah, yeah, I think we can budget into Colossal Blast. What do you mean it's gonna start with a charge? I don't see the problem here. <laughs> what's, what's the problem, officer? Hmm? Uh, basically, Bob Ed could also use the fucking MP at this point. See, this is a loss of four magic damage and three protection to get seven wisdom. I think that's important. We still have plenty of protection thanks to that big stick up there. Big stick! Let's fucking go. Warriors of Desecration. I will not accept a, uh, a fight-long stun. Do one of you have a procurement order? It's a scroll of banishment. That's not a procurement order. Nah, I don't see one. I see a splitting mirror. Oh, good. You lined up. You love to see it. Yeah, I'll set myself on fire. That's my commitment. My dedication to the cause. Look at them all. Look at all the rocks. Look at all the MP I have. I'm ready. This summer. Spiky defense, only four damage. Pshaw. Nine AP, huh? I'm actually going to throw a rocket. Okay. Yeah, you might have 61 protection. That's still... <laughs> some amount of damage. You have 55 protection. Oh, and I crit on that? Fuck your spiky defense. Hell yeah. <gasps> How could this happen? Mortis. Mortis was too young. Too beautiful. Mortis, you will be missed. A true Mortis engine, a star like none other. So 
pretty strong knockback on a singular punch. That's uh, that's guaranteed knockback. Knock target back eight tiles. Damage is strength times two. So, you know, 52 damage there going against max protection. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. But I think, I think we got a couple of evil twins in us. Well, an evil twin. Only the one is wearing this plus four AP ring. Who's going to get twinned up? I think the answer. They're both team players? Ha. Huh. Is you. Don't do it! Ow. <laughs> Fucking did it. Fucked up after I said don't do it. Man, jeez. Ma. Okay, good enough. Oh. Kalen. No, my clone's coming back. <laughs> oh, shit. We're just having a rip roaring good time with this, Red. Chaotic Sickness does not consume a turn. Hey, discount big bastard. I think, uh, I'm gonna get down with the sickness. Bloated Covert Turbulent. Pretty mad about all these. Harlan, we're role-playing here. I dare say you're, uh, well... This probably doesn't apply anymore. You've... Yeah. Turbulent. In your memory. Discount, big bastard. Deadly for nine physical damage. Could be a straight-up predator. A predator. Predatorial big bastard. Yes. The predator. Alright, I said I was in the market for some potions, and it was gonna be potions of agility, and I don't see a fucking potion of agility there. I wanted Potions of Agility to soup up Bobette's agility so that we could uh, take off the ring so I could put on the mirror I bought, which would be really swell. Like, super swell. Like, you don't even know. Like, how swell? Like, oh my god, you know, like, real? But... That didn't happen. I'm not seeing any armor here that says, uh, have action points. So, what do we do about that? Tears? Tears. No tears, please. It's a waste of suffering. Gotta buy that. Give that to Big Bastard so that he has some fucking MP. That he can use his moves. I don't know. Now, now we're kind of attached to that. Hold that thought. I'm gonna buy, I think I'm going to buy that and I'm going to reroll looking for agility. Okay, we got some agility. Cool. Seven, and I think I am going to sell this. And I'm going to Bye. That. I put you at four action points. We can work with four. Four is a good number. 
Four is the number of discount big bastards. It's not six, but it's four. Four will do. I want to put this on in exchange for that damage. I don't think so. We have ring. Say no. I say nay. You got the rock. Have some more strength. Put this on, please. Three, six, two. It's right music. Use some more hit points on the team. A little fragile. Give this to you. Give this to you. That's one hell of a... Uh, that's one hell of a hit. Okay. Cool. I said I was gonna dip out of uh, this event. For the elite, and I meant it. Double damage. Oh, shit. Well. Double damage, you say. And they go first, you say. I'm about to get bull charged, you say. And then attacked, you say. No, 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 I'm not. Wait. 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 Oh, shit. It's double damage. Yeah, Death Heaven, I hear you. This is totally a mistake I would fucking make. This is absolutely 100% an error I would perform. And I think that's a non-zero possibility, even after I've seen the AI do this. I... It's like, like... Like, you perform a wicked cool move, and, like, the judge who's, like, looking over the table looks at you and, like, Okay. And, like, your opponent's, like... That fucking sucks, bro. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah, the clone's up. The clone's... I think I'm going to save. Your battle progress will not be saved. Okay, good to know. I've never tried to exit in the battle before. I didn't know if it would just go to like the start of battle or whether it would save in like the middle of the battle. Okay, that's cool. I am going to, uh, since then I assume that the game has made a save at the start of battle automatically. I'm gonna make a backup of the save. We'll call this, uh, Uh, double damage clone dunk. Double damage split dunk? Yeah. Okay, something like that. We'll, uh, we'll just name it like that, and what the hell, we'll take a screenshot. Well, anyway, that's cursed. Well, it's a good thing I'm not relying on split. <laughs> Let's see if I can, uh... Oh, by the way, Bone Bone over there. I would, you know, offer to clean that up, but, uh, you know, uh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez, man. Come on. Come on, jeez. 
focused assault. Oh, that's 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 death train basically. If Zago could, uh, if Zago just had two AP available instead of being the frozen orb down to one, that could just come flying at me. Could stand here. Howdy! How much damage is that? <laughs> You love to see it. <laughs> I mean, there is a whole stubborn thing there. You, you know, we'll uh, we'll probably figure it out. I went shielded on. I was hoping for that to take care of that problem. Makes sense to do that with your turn. Ah, oh, here's where the minus two AP comes to bite us in the ass. I am I am not 86ing that Efron. <laughs> just We'll do it for 83. Yeah, 86ing that I said, but it was also 186. It made sense. Okay, let's see if I can remove this curse over here. That's that's kind of important to me. Okay. It's been addressed. Well, yeah. Like, that's a clone. Like, you, you win if the last units that are standing are summoned units. <laughs> Come get me. Oh, uh, hmm. Now I guess you're gonna come get the angel. You fool, don't do it! Oh. Okay. Fine. I was- I was gonna- I was gonna evil twin, man. But I guess... I guess I'll just do this. 64 protection! You'd think, hmm, reducing damage by 64% is a good thing. Why am I taking 78 damage here? Why am I taking 156 damage here? Forty-four MP, you say? That we can we can do what we need to do with fifty-three MP. That way, we can actually get some physical damage in there. Cool. Can't forget the discount. Right, discount big bastard is a predator. Just disgusting. Nice moves out there. You bet, champ. You bet. The followers of Revelation. You want a random unremovable buff? You got it. I don't give a fuck. I know double damage, right? It's really crowded here. 8 AP, 2 AP, 2 AP, 4 AP. If is has a focused assault, which is a pretty nice skill, but like I noted, it's pretty crowded here. Do one of you fuckers have a procurement order? No, it's just naturally this crowded. Gotcha. Great. I love it. Oh, I love it! I don't think he loves it. I think he's deceiving us. It's fucked up. That's a lot of hit points, by the way. And, uh, that's hazard protection for ten turns. Spiky defense. Hazard protection. Hazard protection. Uh, also... Piercing resolve... Gotcha. That's why they all have hazard protection. 
Ithis got hit with that. And so every time a buff supplied to him, applied to surrounding allies. But yeah, okay, yeah. That's fine. I understand. Everything's good. Don't worry about it. You're worrying about it, chat room. Don't do that. Have a debuff. Or not. I don't want to deal with that. Come on over. You fucking 8 AP prowler. Who you hitting? You sick fuck. That's fucked up. Use the fire last turn. Hmm, kind of put myself out here for fucking nothing, huh? Shield up! I'm gonna blame that on fatigue. Yeah, it's the it's the fatigue's fault. I think that Bobette is gonna is gonna take care of this fine, just fine. I have the utmost faith and confidence. You don't really have an attack angle on the others. So I should have you stay behind and work on this. Now, on the one hand, I could clone. On the other hand, I just kill. Howdy. You know, I didn't end up having to pay for that attack there as much as I thought I would. I'm cool with that. No tears, please. It's a waste of good suffering. You only have two AP. You have Harmonious Discharge. Cool. You have two AP as well. You can bring teammates back. Don't do it. Ah. Lined up for that. That's fucked up. Does that blood go all the way? It could go all the way, but it doesn't. I'll leave you with one hit point. Just put burning on you. Just crit. Just fucking crit. Easy. Easy game. Easy game, easy life. Just considered a critical hit. Hmm? You can have him back. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> These angels aren't that strong in melee, but uh, the, the ones I cloned compared to all that protection, but they'll do okay. Angle this so I don't knock back in my teammate. Damn, credit to you for being able to take that shot with your 60 protection. Go get him, team. Go get him. Right, you're still fucking immune. I love how I'm just like, yeah, yeah, I got this. The rock's back. I can't reach. But it has returned to us. All right. We're going to see a, another skill being offered here at level 10 for the angel. Purple relic. Pushing a barrel does not consume a turn. Spiny effigy. Indestructible helmet's pretty nice. I do like that. Of course, that can be cleaned up with a double tap of, like, collision damage. Ha ha tee hee. I do like that as an option. Even if I might not put it on. Speaking of options. Vile rain... Detonate minion and precise burst. Precise burst, you say? Gains a charge when unit performs a melee attack, you say? We'll start with one charge, you say? 150% of magic damage, you say? I'm hearing, I'm hearing a lot of things here, yes. You know? I might actually drop lightning and keep the incinerate. That's wild. No, 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 no. I'll drop the incinerate. Colossal Blast has the range of five, yeah. Puppet's kind of cracked here. Summon the dead? I mean, I guess. <laughs> Corpse explosion, boiling blood, and consume. Consume. If target has less HP than 10% of your max HP, damage is equal to target's current HP. Heal yourself equal to damage dealt. Damage fierce protection. It's a flat 5 damage, but... If, say, they had... Less than six hit points, fewer than seven or eight. That would be the damage to consume would deal, and we would heal that. Rewards, uh, I think that's more of like a an endless sort of thing. Though I have had like dudes with 150 plus hit points in these runs. It's a pretty fun fight. Tools of his member, enemy characters are tougher. How tough? Plus 10, plus 10s. I'm good. We're not doing these things for score. After all, I've already unlocked everything. Glaciate? Glaciate. Sinister readjustment, barrel burial, purging detonation. You have one AP base. Otherworldly blade, though. You got some web. Berserker ritual. Blood! 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 What? Am I willing to get knocked back five times in my own skelly bro in order to set this Eleanor on fire? What if, hear me out, we didn't accept that outcome and we just sent that barrel to the abyss? Yeah, to the abyss with thee! I don't want to be glaciated. Hold up. I'm not here to get glaciated, good sir. I'm not able to throw my rock unless at that pressure barrel. That's okay. That's right, Pan Anning. 
Fair and noble Christoph. I don't need to duplicate you. You're a chump. We'll, uh... Yeah, we can still reach by moving there. We'll do that. The crowd. They eat it up. They love blood. And I love to give them blood. This frozen orb, man. Allows you to set up some plays. <laughs> Out here with 21 magic damage and 7 wisdom. Eat this rock. Are you... I mean, fine, I guess. So you have chosen death. <laughs> I like how I do have Evil Twin as an option, and it's it's highly entertaining, but it's also like, eh, you know, if it's just, what if I just sent you directly to hell? Do it. It's gotta be horrifying. That's... It's almost like some caves of gun shit. <laughs> Evil twin. Like, you just, like, transition screens, and, you know, you're just, like, some high-powered, like, psychic mutant. And there's, like, two of you, like, No! My evil twins have gathered! Fuck. Ah, I see. Rooted. Oh. Oh. I mean, let's let's mix it up with precise burst. What the hell? No, colossal blast. Sucker punch, caustic tide, endure. Uh, endure is a nifty armor piece. I don't think I'll replace any of mine currently, though. That robe does present a reasonable argument to get replaced. Don't think so. The boots of imminent end for 5 AP, but you take damage with every step. We could afford that, but we're pretty okay with AP. It's not like we have more artifact slots. All right, Andy. This is, this is your chance. You want to fucking appear right here? You better fucking believe Andy does. I've been following you all this time. Now let's fight! Andy is about to be terrifying as fuck, and this item will not be worth it. Light seed, it's... I mean, I can definitely see build potentials around that. Random debuffed all surrounding units at the end of this unit's turn. A debuff could be anything. Anyway, let's, uh... Let's proceed to get schooled by Andy, shall we? Andy the Beast is, uh... Well, potent. It's going to be a 3v5. Here's Andy. You know. You know. <laughs> yep. <laughs> that's, uh, that's Beast Andy. The artifact he gives you is just, like, so not worth taking this fight. I wonder what happens if you tell him no. Like, how dare you reject me in this moment? I have trained so hard. I am Golden Andy. Andy's out here with a slimy tail and alien object. I'm pretty sure like this, like we saw this exact same like loadout with him. Perks, gear, stats that we had before. Cause I recognize him like bleeding acid mist from the first time we fought Super Andy. And I mean like, 14 action points, 48 physical damage, 57 knockback chance. 
He's stubborn, he's frenzyable. Uh, we'd want to clone him. If we could actually clone him. But 48 damage times 2 from a crit kind of means any of our team could go down. It's a 3v5, and Andy is, uh, by all accounts, the scariest member of their team. And we cannot easily pit Andy. I checked. God bless this music again. But he does only have one AP at the start of this turn, thanks to Frozen Orb. So maybe we can uh, build this world together. Standing strong forever. I don't think does bone will carry us. Straight up cremate, eh? Eh? You gotta pounce. Gotta remember that. Yeah, we'll stay here. Wait, it's not like it mattered. <laughs> Lightning storm. Sinister readjustment. Everyone get debuffed. Burning. Just hoping for something like rooted. Stunned. My Frieza is showing. That's probably true. Thank heavens that could have gone worse with that tornado place, but... Is there a way this can line up to allow me to annihilate these enemies? To sound like Chris Bourbon here. He, 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 the Raiders. <laughs> Tis a silly game. I will stand here. I will go no further. I will reluctantly end my turn. It's a good hit. Nope. Yeah, we'll clear the way for Skelly Bro to take take charge. Please. Okay. I could have been worse. This fucking music track. Okay. Andy! You goonies! Good enough for you. It's <laughs> Good enough for me. It's good enough. Good enough for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. No! <laughs> You monster! Eat this rock! How could you do this to Dustbone? All we are is dust in the wind, dude. Do I hope the tornado carries me forward instead of into the pit? Hmm. It's a pity that George can't go diagonal here. We could, uh... We could do the things. I guess we could just charge the fucking barrel. I don't... I don't want to get knocked back five tiles at an opportune time. Huh? Ah, oh, well. They can't all be winners. You are shielding Andy here. And it's kind of... It's kind of fucked up, man. Now, of course... Andy doesn't go down to this. Andy uh, is stubborn. Andy will get a turn. 
But is there someone I want to deny having a turn here? I think the answer is yes. I don't want this Dryad to take a turn. With 5 AP. Could Sinister readjustment me? <coughs> also has not, uh... Mana fiended me, and I don't want to see a Death Defiant there. We're gonna... We're just gonna take care of uh, that Dryad. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> uh-huh. Oh, if only that it cost a collision! Last gasp, pain in the ass! Cannot reach Andy with you, but I know what I must do besides talk like this. It's the only way. Multi Andy! <laughs> <laughs> All right, we win. Thanks, Multi Andy. Immunity to knockback and a nice silver ring there. But our slots are busy doing things. I want you to have plus one action point. I want you to have plus eight hit points here. I want you to have plus 16 hit points here. Discount, big bastard. Let's grab some treasure. Andy has been resolved. Multi Andy. Like we're playing Pachinko. Oh, there's supply signal. Unholy Rebirth. Resurrect an enemy unit with 30% HP and force them to join your team. I mean. I mean, it would start with a charge. I mean, I think we got enough baller moves, truth. Mass Renewal does not consume a turn. Some monsters, some of the high level unit of your team, it would be two of them. Split. <laughs> oh, shit. Conjured Assault. Deal damage to all surrounding units. Strength plus wisdom plus three. If if Bobette here wasn't already so damn loaded, I I would be intrigued. But Bobette is so fucking loaded. If only we could have more than four skills, right? From books. Let's not consume a turn. I don't think regenerating is bad, but he healing five hit points could make a difference. It could. It could. It could. I think we're gonna drop Spiteful Thrust here and slam that book down. Hey. It's not the book I meant to slam down. No, my money that I wasted. No. <coughs> that, that book was, I don't know, maybe close to 200 gold. Just set it on fire. Warriors don't read books. Jaw gone. Oh, well. Shit happened. Thankfully, it's only hard difficulty with uh, my only challenge modifier being a team size of three. And with Skelly Bro, it's basically like a team size of four anyway. Let's take care of these barrels that might otherwise fuck me. Okay. I think this is the first time I've seen Diffuse Acid be used against me. Because you have to target an acid mistile to delete it. So, yeah. Congratulations. You did it. You fucked me with it. You made my moving movement kinda awkward. What do you mean that doesn't kill? It doesn't kill. You could use a fifth action point. 
Crit. Damn. What do you mean me just, like, trying to channel a crit didn't work? Hey, that's what splitting looks like when you don't just immediately get yourself killed through it. Hmm, wind affliction. Uh, yeah. Put it here. Burn out the day. Burn out the night. You know, I never debuffed the squad. That's on me. Who else would it be on? <laughs> mm. Who dies? Is it you, clone? It's you. I don't even have to use a skill for this. Delightful. That's discount big bastard for you. I, I handed the body back. Here, you resurrect him. Ow, ow. That's fucked up. That's it. Is there blood around here? Not, not as much as you'd want. Not as much as you'd want. This fight is over. Blue gadget. Vitalize, I'm probably gonna sell that cloak. I mean, it's, it's better. Event. <laughs> Andy, take four. What the fuck are you doing here, Andrew? Andrew! <laughs> What is with this? Enough, Andrew. I choose this effect. Barrel chain mass detonation rocket blast. No thanks. We're kinda we're kinda loaded. We need to buy more accessory slots. Are you are you selling accessory slots by chance? I'm gonna take that as a no. Or a big fat maybe. <laughs> I don't think what we're doing is lightning storm oriented, and I, I might put on this indestructible helmet before like. If I, like it would be cool if I could, like stack the regenerating bone onto Bobette as well. Some an extra copy, but the main stats are lowered. But you know, it's nice to have the full stats there, and you know, like so many slots. Also nice to have four members on the team, you know. Four team members.
I don't think that ring enough. This dagger. Yeah. Yeah. Now we just need the armor that, uh... Like the mana shield armor? It'd be gold in there. Let's uh, see if we can find that, yep. Not seeing it. Damn. Summon Spectre. Apply Stun to Gaster. Cremate. Detonate Magic. Door Light and Shout. Bending Warm Up. Lose some wisdom in exchange for an assload of HP on Bobette. Don't dislike that. How are we looking weapons wise? Pick this up. Provides the Conjured Tendril skill. We will forget that skill. And I will sell this. I'll sell the Lightning Stone. He says, walking past the Lightning Stone. It's time for us to forget Dragon's Breath now, too. I want to see some meaty fucking melee skills here, champ. Enhanced Thunderbolt? I mean, I guess. That's not. That's not the meat I'm looking for, but. I mean, I guess. Let's forget Lightning. Put on Enhanced Thunderbolt, and then. I'm gonna take off the Splitting Mirror here and put on the Lightning Stone, because I wanna see this at work. Rain of Knives. Ooh. You could definitely use an upgraded weapon, though. One that would be giving you MP as well. Reactive Plate. This unit gets impervious if attacked in melee. Huh. A lot of fucking armor. And if you get whacked, you get plus 80 protection. That, However, that caps out at 70 by this point. We're pretty good on that. Reroll. Noxious Stab, Rags, Harmonious Discharge, just only deal 20... <sighs> That's only 21 damage. For you, that'd be a whopping 55. That's a no. Well, weapons. That is... It's an ass load of MP, but would drop the physical damage. 100 crit chance on you. We'd go from a 9 crit chance to a 100 crit chance. We wouldn't have the MP to do the things I'd want to do, though. Yep. Uh, the one challenge modifier I am with this run, because we're playing, I'm playing on hard difficulty just to, tr I wanted to see what hard difficulty entailed, is that our team size is limited to three. Uh, as a note, though, you do level up quicker. Fewer, fewer gladiators needing the experience. Chaotic Sickness. I could pick that skill up, I guess. Debuffs and just have Bobette, like, walk around slaying everything. That's not... Kinda... Kinda want some big melee hits here. You're not, you're not working with me here, game. Let's give it another reroll. Singular Punch. Okay, we can work with that. Purging Lunge. We can work with that. <sighs> I 
I guess you're just getting a bunch of, like, physical damage from the plate. I'd like to have gotten more stuff that added raw strength, but... Such is life. Is there an armor I think I would buy for her? 392? There's a dried robes. We could, we could swing a 392. How does that look? Try before you buy. 19, huh? 19's enough to cast the mass from renewal. I was thinking about giving that to discount Big Bastard, but she just, like, she needs the skill filled out. Would have would have liked to have seen some uh, some other more impactful skills be offered. We're gonna save the rest of the cash though, and not re-roll here again. We got another shop coming up. Slaves of the afflicted, double damage. I will mount you on my wall. Look at all these fucking shoes, man. Okay, bud. Just tuning in, the enemies only have one action point on the first round because we've managed to pick up a frozen orb, which is great because that guy's got 12 AP. That guy's got 8 AP. There's a 3 there. There's a 4 there. I'm seeing some scary skills in there. A sacred blade, a conjured assault, a singular punch. 42 physical damage here with that sacred blade, too. And you have a bunch of magic damage with a cremate. Big cremate. Cremating it. Okay. Four, three, two, pull, kill, kill, overkill. Understood. <laughs> Keep off their team. Go in. Magic needle. It's okay. We can we can take that kind of damage because this is a run where we're allowed to do that. Also, <laughs> oh, that wasn't even a crit. <clears throat> Uh-huh. Yes, yes, yes. Lose out on some hit points for that. But I might love it. Give you control of the bones, give you 7 AP to wiggle around. The strength befitting your rock, so that strength can help your punch. We'll sell this. And that that. Yeah. That's pretty satisfying. It's not helping my teammates earn more experience when I obliterate everyone with Bobette. But, uh, I think that's a skill issue for them. Enemy characters are tougher? Sure. Be tougher. Get your plus 10 to all your stats. Fuck it. Have it. I'm feeling, I'm feeling turbo arrogant right now. Turbo arrogant. Oh yeah, this music track. This song fucking slaps. All oh, right, you kind of need that for Conjure Tendril. Well, right. We have made a boo-boo. It's a lot of fucking action points on this squad. Okay, well. Shit happens. Will it result in our demise? Maybe. It's a 
solid hit. Rain and Knives with its flat 7 damage is just not something that's going to be scaling right here at this moment of time. Oh. I mean, that is a lot of magic damage. It makes fucking sense, right? Oof. Discount, big bastard. No! Get out of here with your Deptified. I did give them an ass load of bonuses to stats for this fight. Well, I guess I'm not cloning you like I wanted to. We're only going to get the one clone, and I don't think she's getting another turn. I also did want to get Dex to discount Big Bastard and resurrect before I cloned, but I have lost that opportunity. You know, that stun fades away at the end of her turn. She, it just means that she can't take any more actions, which I mean, like, well, of course she can. That's what resurrections look like. Damn it. Okay. If, uh, if my tiefling goes down of Harlan E, I lose this fight. Five, four, three, two, one. I can reach to attack you. Four, three, two, one. I can come around and maybe get like a knockback chance. Shield ourselves along the way. Remove all buffs and debuffs. Would rather not. Let's try shielding. Damn. Priorities. Priorities. I mean, that was a resurrected person, so, I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> There's her loss. No rewards. That's okay. It was the last fight why I decided to go so fucking ham with it. You're allowed to lose two fight- well, you're allowed to lose a fight per level. And all- all is okay, though you don't get any rewards for it. If you're playing on a higher glory level that doesn't allow you, like, full heals after fights, you're gonna be in a really rough situation. You're not allowed to lose a second fight in a level, you're not allowed to lose a boss fight. So... Fuck it. This will actually be the, uh... The first time we've, uh, we've lost two fights and not just outright lost a run. Has there been zero losses or one loss? Gotta have fun in life, right? And show that as it turns out, <laughs> things can go wrong. Discount Big Bastard can be, he can be beaten. He can be driven back. Six AP there, that's pretty good. I think I'm drinking this potion. Singular punch would be better on him. I think the I want to roll for vitality now. 80 ish HP is just not good enough. We got one vitality here. There is Focused Assault. And another Singular Punch. I sell him the mirror. I think I will sell the mirror. This, the mirror was fun. I like the Lightning Stone. It's pretty fun, too. Who gets the extra HP? You do. Discount Big Bastard. Your, your going down in that last fight was pretty, uh... Pretty fucking uncomfortable. I'm gonna be dropping two skills on you, or just the one? That's definitely getting dropped. I think it... So you get punch. 
You get Focused Assault. That leaves you without a charge, but you have 7 AP. You have Focused Assault, and you don't have a chain except through Conjured Tendril here on your item. Okay, that's fine. Let's go. Why would you think trolls are resistant to magic? Why are you applying logic from, like, other video games and settings to this one? There's no magic resistance there. Why are you trying to roleplay this? There's Bach. The flanker. Yeah, losing out on the big damage of uh, Discount Big Bastard. Lamentable. 31 knockouts, 33 knockouts, 2172 damage, 1572. And then Bobette here, 18 knockouts. The one death there in that prior fight. 1595 damage. There's the Emperor. Let's go. where we die. So, hard mode has, you know, particularly with our limited team of three, has definitely packed a punch. That there is no doubt. I can do that from one more distance away. What was my favorite? Oh, man. I don't have one. There, there are so many of them that are pretty satisfying. So many of them that are pretty satisfying. That resurrect one would have been nice had I not gotten swatted away from Discount Big Bastard in that last fight. Uh, the wizard one, the AI is really great at using to teleport the fucking wizard in to nuke your ass. The gnome one does the hidden thing. The chained one is a nice pull, though I find that it's not as uh, large Lorg as I like. I'm spoiled by this damn conjured bramble. I really enjoy this conjured bramble. The range of eight, man. Like, what the fuck? My, if my racial skill could be conjured Bramble, then we'd, we would be in business, sir. We would be in business. Anyway, you're dead. Enjoy. I can reach? Fuck yeah. I do, I do love me a good throw rock. I enjoyed that in the first game, too. Throw Rock, Death Train, or in this particular case, Focus Assault. I think the Wizard one is just, like, the, the one that's the most, like, impactful, like, for the AI. So, I, I suppose that's not my favorite so much as, like, fuck! Fucking Wizards! <laughs> I've made, uh, I made strong use out of Combustion here for the Fiendling. Range 3, cooldown 3. Uh, it deals damage when you place it down. It doesn't consume a turn. But the racials don't. Puts a burning debuff on the enemy. That's that's a pretty good carry in the early game. A lot of fucking hit points. And you are going to go after that troll, doubtlessly, to bring them back to life for me to smite again. I think we just accept that. Be with you in a moment, Emperor. I think that the takeaway here is, uh, as is the case with many things, Fickle Grimmith doesn't have a favorite. And you can't make Fickle Grimmith pick a favorite. It deals so much more damage to you, because you only have 20 protection. This fucking angel has 60. I mean, you gotta throw a rock. Oh, it's because you have minus 50 protection. You're vulnerable for a turn. Fuck it. Throw a rock at the Emperor and crit with it. Hell yeah. Fuck you, Emperor. How do you like me now? Of course, then I move here to sort of like body block any attack angle, but I think that's gonna happen anyway. Don't worry. We have other moves we can do. 
Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay, technically the stone one still exists for me to evil twin. It's been a pretty fun run. This is not important. This is important. I guess someone will not ex exist anymore for me to be able to win. I'd have to reach. Three, four, five, that's not enough range. My movement would stop right here. That wouldn't get you. Well, anyway. To the Emperor we go. Hello. go. The Emperor's default skills just are, like... It renders him a support character more so than anything else. He just... Like, he doesn't have a whole lot of killing power. I think some of the bosses are more dangerous than him. And... Well... This doesn't have a whole lot going for him compared to some of the other scarier ship. Well, no evil time. That's fine. Take our crown. Crush your arms, take them, throw into the curve, say. The cure, not the curve. I do believe. New high score. Score for apparently hard difficulty. I've also won 10 games, and I have won a game on hard difficulty. Those were my achievements. Who gets the crown? Looks like it's going to be discount big bastard. Put aside that bracelet, my friend, and put on the crown of the champion. That's you. We lost two fights. 129. Our player team size was limited to three. I got 87 enemies. We spent a good chunk of gold. Most valuable character was Bob Ed. Most expensive. There were plenty of stats there. The rest is short. Really enjoyed that angel this run. That was, uh, was pretty satisfying. And uh, I'm okay with the skill lay layout at the end there for the final fight. A couple of... A couple of singular punches, a focused assault. And 44 fucking wisdom there from the gear. A colossal blast we started charged with, a precise burst we started charged with, an enhanced thunderbolt. An evil twin, just for the hell of it, just for funsies. And we saw we saw those evil twins come into great effect. I think I'd rather just deal raw damage. Uh but you know. If only we had the fourth character slot to fuck around with shit like that. May light shine upon those who persevere and bring eternal glory to their name. Yes, indeed. It takes care of the small team challenge, and apparently we have a separate trophy to denote that it was done on hard difficulty. I did not know the game would do that. And indeed, Fiendling has a different colored trophy as well. And uh, the glory levels will too. I did not know that would happen. Hmm, makes sense. Okay. Cool. Fiendling can look different from the rest. And perhaps the werewolf daddy can look the most different of all. Starts with a chaotic perk potion. Gains a random perk. It could be anything. That's right for re-rolling. That's for fucking sure. Kitsune summons a 1 HP Spectre. I do like that. Doesn't consume a turn. Uh, Spectres don't get your gear. They have half your stats, but they do have your skills. So you can get the Spectres to... Shit. They get added to the initiative. I really like that one. Uh, the pounce is pretty nifty. I got any complaints about that. Drink blood. That's pretty nifty. Rising tide. Yeah, you got to get adjacent to them. Sharp scales. I haven't had a lizard bed on the team, but so it's just been me confronting a bunch of lizards. You get plus thirty protection and then like some melee defense. Like you attack the bleeding. Nature's grasp is nifty. Uh, does it uh, applies rooted to a neighboring target? Uh, this random debuff could be anything. Also, use a random perk potion. Uh, angel here with the resurrect. I haven't had a whole lot of angels on the team to really make use of that. Uh, bull charge is very flexible. It's some good shit. 
It goes diagonals, horizontally, vertically. You charge towards someone, knock them back three tiles. Of course, then cause a bunch of collision damage. It really helps the Minotaur close the distance and allows you to follow up with a like a big old beefy attack. Big fan of bullet charge. Here's Blink for the fucking wizard. Just allows you to teleport across the distance and vaporize someone. Regenerate is, eh, is what it is. Soul Chain, pretty nifty. Allows uh, you to close the gap by pulling them toward you. So that you can then follow up with a potent melee attack. Tempest Touch, I do like. Being able to knock a target back four tiles, not consuming a turn. You can fling them into terrain, you can fling them into pits. Cause collision damage. Summon Barrel is... it's a thing. A barrel could be anything. Doesn't consume a turn to summon it, but of course... Uh, you gotta spend a turn to fling it, unless you have some special accessories. Haste is... For the moment, I would say this is my favorite. The ability for the elf to just get plus three action points, that can override, say, like, Oh, you've been slow. You only have one action point. Not so fast, my friend. Now I have four action points. Aha! It's, like, the, what you can do with that extra maneuverability, especially in the early game, when you're looking at, like, one to three AP, then you have to, like, take a turn off of haste, but then the next turn it's back on. You get four charges of that in a fight. I really like that. Mind lock, the fucking slither shit, increases enemy school cooldowns by one can be rude. And you can do that a little bit distance away. The gnome uh, hides, can't be directly targeted, can be indirectly targeted, plus 35 crit chance. And to the combustion. Yeah. I think that's a like glow up things. Howl here. Yeah, it's not bad. Minus 15 protection, why should you deal more damage? That's right, Joshua. Random perk potion could be anything. So that was hard difficulty, and you know, I did take a pair of losses along the way. One was because I was fucking around, and then the the first one I took was just because of an unfavorable crit that I did not have any realistic hope of dealing with at that stage of the game. Like, just overrode my max HP. Was it the second fight we got into? Yeah. I'm interested in trying Master, but that will be for next time. I have... I broadcasted a solid chunk of this game over the past 12 hours. Last night, now early this morning. And I dare say that I am done playing Mortal Glory 2 for a while. Uh, I don't expect to be back with this any time within the next... 16 hours. Uh, perhaps tomorrow early morning my time, or maybe tomorrow later on. Depends on my energy whether I actually can get some comfy sleep. If I do get comfy sleep, fuck all you bitches, I'll need this shit. <laughs> Is mind lock effective? The unit has that leap which removes cooldowns? I don't have a firm and definitive answer to that question. If I were to hazard a guess, I would say Everleaf wins. Based on prior behavior, uh, we have seen with the Hasty perk and the Everleaf item. And I don't know for certain whether the Angel Resurrection does allow you to pick up gladiators on the battlefield in permadeath. I would assume so, but I have not played with the permadeath challenge modifier, so I do not know it to be true. Anyway, that is going to do it for this broadcast. Mortal Glory 2 remains a quite enjoyable game, well worth the price of admission, I do dare say, which I believe for the next two weeks will remain 9.59 US dollars.